to access Google Classroom, you can find it in the Apps Chooser, which some people refer to as the waffle. So when you click on the 3 by 3 grid of dots in the upper right hand corner, you can come down and see that Classroom is one of the options. And so that'll take you to Classroom. The other way to get there is to just open a new tab and type in classroom.google.com and that will also take you to Google Classroom. Now one of the things that you want to know about Google Classroom is that you want to make sure that you're logged into only one account. So notice that there are two places to log into your Google account. Up here at the top, this is the Chrome browser login and down here, this is the window login. Now up at the top, you can have as many as you want, which you see I have a lot, but on the one that's right next to the apps chooser, right next to the waffle, this larger one, you want there to only be one account. So you see that I have two accounts. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna sign out of all accounts. Now at this screen, do not choose sign in again, instead choose continue, and you wanna remove an account. Remove an account, remove the extra accounts. Yes, remove. You want to have only one account showing. We're gonna sign in. so that when I click on my picture, there's only one account shown. This is super important, because it will just automatically switch accounts. It'll just, you'll log in, you'll swear you're logged in on the right account, and it'll tell you you don't have access, or it'll create your documents in the other account. It will have issues with your add-ons. It is really important that when you click on the picture next to the apps chooser, that it only shows one account. Your one for Chrome can have as many as you want.